most of the time when these people be talking, I don't even hear them. I don't. They talk and they talk, but I do not hear shit when I'm near them. I swear to God that I came. What is going on, guys? Today I am well. I'm not on a normal server right now. I'm actually on the server I've been slowly working on, and some of you may know that I've been slowly working on, and. I wasn't planning on making a video this early, but I kind of needed some of your guys' opinions on what to do next, because I kind of want you guys to choose some things. So there's going to be a straw poll in the description of where home will be located, um, whether Barrow should have 1 out of 10 kill count, so on and so on. The only reason that there's lower to higher kill counts and drop rates or not kill count drop rates I should say is because I don't know if I should make it really low to increase activity for PKing if I should put it in a shop or make it wanna make it really rare or what I should really do and then for the home situation I want to put that in there just so you guys can go ahead and tell me where you guys would rather have home and I can start redoing shops and because that's not hard it is not hard at all, but it takes a lot of time and it is literally the most annoying thing of coding a server is redoing all the shops. One thing I do also like, I'm not taking any like um, credit or responsibility for this interface right here. The next video I will shout out, I'll try finding the actual dev who dev this interface, if he did. and give him a shout out because the interface is awesome I'm honestly leaving the interface um, I was looking around these two quests are we're already here I don't know if they fully work yet but if they do I'll make my own little changes to them maybe add another small quest they're not full on quest quest but they're mini quest that makes sense obviously um, I had to fix a couple things in this interface, but other than that, I think I'm going to leave it how it is because it gets to the point and everything is here. I mean, you got your all your player info from your rank to your name to your task, your slayer task streak. Down here, you got your points, vote points, dungeon points. I'm not quite sure. I haven't really looked into dungeoneering yet if there is dungeoneering, um, but if there's not, let me know in the comment section if that's something you would want to see. I've had a lot of people tell me that that's not something they would really want to see, but then a lot of people tell me that it is. Once again, it is all up to you guys. That's why I'm making this video, to leave your suggestions on what you want to see in a server and make it come true. Um, down here we got your quick links to your forms and everything, and once I go ahead and get all my web devving done, all that stuff will be linked up. Um, I'm going to be getting a VPS in a couple days for a closed beta. Um, not really quite sure who's all going to be in it. I sent a little mass Skype out to everybody earlier. And down here you got your boss logs that has your basic bosses. I'm also going to be adding Zora and trying to add Lizard Shamans. If I do, it'll be really hard considering that's 108 cash. And this is surprisingly, this is a 317 cache apparently, but it's loading so many other revisions. Right now, this is one of the homes. There's two homes. There's a home in Edgeville, which has a bunch of shops up here. And then there is a home at colon colon home. I also re need to redo some of the teleports because... There's there's a, all the lodestone works, but I realized that there's not any skilling teleport, so I had to manually go around and find where the skilling places are, and that's actually where you get um, a skill cape. And I looked over here. I'm gonna have to finish this or take this out because I don't know anybody that's really done something like this besides one or two other servers. But the wise old man doesn't s sell. <laughs> can't talk does not sell skill capes it's refer a player referred by a user referral rewards and all that but say you want a skill cape over here is Ali the Smith this is like the smithing skilling area and you can go ahead and talk to him I'd like to buy a smithing skill cape obviously I'm maxed right there so I can get a max cape from max but I wanna go ahead and change all this stuff up and 
make it kind of my own. I want to change all the stalls, put the stall somewhere different, change all the loot from them. But before I can go on with stuff that's time consuming like that, I'd like to get your guys' feedback for the next day or two to let me know where you would like the home and just please, please go vote in the straw poll down below. Here's Party Pete. You got some stuff. There's a, uh, there's a couple, there's like two or three 718 items in here, like the Black Ibis. I'm not even sure if it's 718, correct me if I'm wrong. Then the Vine Whip, etc., etc. Vine's so sexy. I also do not take any of this for, um, for credit, any of this interface right here. I will change around the, all the, what, I can't even think of what it's called, the achievements. I'll change around all of them though, but the actual interface like that it's based off of, like that you can see right here that it's wrote on, I have no doing in that or the player interface, which I do like this too. I was just here, but I forgot to show you guys. There's top players, all players, staff, and then apparently there's top iron men, most active, and top PKers, which is pretty awesome. The server has working Iron Man. And I gotta finish working on Ultimate Iron Man, I do believe. Maybe I got them too mixed up. I may have been wrong. But here you can change your difficulty and you would reset, you get removed from the high scores and all of that. This is not gonna be like Zenith PvP like I told you guys. Um, I just opened it for a few days to see if I can actually get it on, fix a couple things that people wanted to get fixed, and just kind of get the experience and feel for it before I went on to an eco server. Also, I want to know what you guys think about these bows. I found them. Like, I know you guys have seen the Zerite bow, whatever. Zerite, Zerite, I can't talk today. But there's also the Hex Hunter bow I'm sure you guys have seen. And then, where is it at? This bow right here, I fucking love. I don't know why. I, I just don't know why. It's like I could just one take your nan with it or something. I'm probably going to start everybody off in the, with the starter items with, like, Navite items. Like, just to make it a little different than other servers. Like, a Navite Rapier, and a Navite Shield, and a Navite Staff. Maybe some Navite Armor. But other than that, it won't be anything too different. But, once again, let me know what you guys think. I really, really appreciate all feedback, negative and positive. So... Hit me with whatever you want, and I'm hoping you guys are having a great summer, and see you soon.